guys, it's Monday. So, you know something weird I was thinking about? The fact that all we really know that connects us is the fact that we are all, like, into the vlog brothers. So, I was thinking I was going to tell you guys some of the other YouTubers I'm, like, in love with just to, like, show. Because I feel like the YouTubers you like kind of says something about yourself. They kind of say something about yourself. Oof, I'm going to be an English major. That was a win. So, I thought I'd just share some of my YouTuber love crushes with you guys. And then maybe you guys can tell me if you love them too. Or maybe I can just find super cool YouTubers for you so it's like I'm using you. So, number one, of course, is the Vlogbrothers. I adore them. I do, I just, I can't, there's nothing they can do. I sat, I watched the 43 minute thing on Hank's, um, Hank's like performance at Playlist Live. I just sat there and watched it. I was like, I had no qualms about it. I was like, 43 minutes, psh, I could listen to four hours of this. It was awesome. I just, I love the Vlogbrothers. I've seen every episode. I just adore them. I'm pretty sure nothing really tops them. But coming in at a very close second is Marymon. Alex Day, probably, if there was no Vlogbrothers, he would be my favorite YouTuber. I just, he's witty, he's adorable, and he's just so, like, bitingly sarcastic, which is kind of rep repetitious of me, but whatever, just go with it. Um, redundant. So yeah, um, Alex Day, huge, huge fan. And from him, I found Charlie McDonald, who I as well love. Yesterday, he taught me how to make brownies, and I was like, Charlie McDonald, you are such a cutie pie. So yeah, um, I'm, I'm in big love crushes with both of them. But then, I have to say, I adore Toby Turner. Like, Tavoskis, I found him from his, like, literal trailers, because I was like, man, these literal tra trailers are awesome. I fell in love with the Harry Potter one for the Deathly Hollows. It's so freaking funny. I don't really play that many video games, so I didn't get most of the other ones. But I was like, this is gold. This guy's a genius. So I started watching Cute Wood Fails. I'm not the biggest Cute Wood Fails like, theme person. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I just don't love it. But I adore his lazy vlogs. I think he's the funniest person ever. Because he's just like, he's kind of like how my brain works, except he vocalizes it. He like wheelies around and just like, woo, woo. He's, he's awesome. I love Toby Turner. So cute. Um, who else do I love? I also love, okay, I know some people like hate him and I don't understand it. I love Michael Buckley from What the Buck. I think What the Buck is one of the funniest things in the world. It's so, like, he does these other things like where he like, acts like he's like Judy Bloom and talks to you about your like emotional instabilities and some people write into him about being like cutters and stuff and that that's kind of creepy but his <laughs> not being a cutter which is kind of creepy sorry I'm not trying to be offensive to anyone but um yeah I just I I think the self-help part's kind of weird but he's hilarious on what the buck when he does like things that are going on in like the media and stuff like that and speaking of people who like cover media stuff I love 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 Sexy Phil. Sexy Phil, so good. I watch it all of the time. Like, every time it's up. I, the intro to that song, to his, like, thing is, like, the, like, this is a new show. But, like, I just adore that. I wish that was, like, what woke me up. I, like, get all dancey from it because I know he's, like, coming on. I totally want his poster, his, like, monkey poster. I want the monkey poster. Um, yes. So, I love Sexy Phil. Um, who else do I love? I love, hmm. oh, this one, I feel like it's kind of like incongruous with the kind of person I am, but I adore Fluffy Talks. Fluffy is so awesome, and I love smoker types, like, yeah, is that, is that right? <laughs> That's how I meant to do it, sorry, I just, I mixed up my different kind of smoking, it was, it was almost really bad, don't worry weed smokers, I got you covered, I know where the, we're good. So, I, I think Fluffy is absolutely hilarious. I think I kind of like him because he's so different from, like, the, the kind of people I usually hang out with. He's just so fucking crazy. I love Fluffy. And, um, yeah, I feel like that basically takes place. Oh, and, of course, like, I like Alex Carpenter. I like, like, Luke Connard. I mean, I don't love them. I like every once in a while when they come out with, like, music. And, like, I like watching, like, the Leaky Cauldron group people, like Leaky TV. I like Harry Potter-based things, that kind of stuff. 
but I mean, I don't like, I don't like search for it in my like inbox thing. I'm like, I get really excited when I was like a new vlog brothers, especially thoughts from places. So TJ, I freaking loved your thoughts from places. Those are my favorite kind of vlog brothers, except the educational videos. I super duper love the educational videos, but like, seriously, I loved your thoughts from places. But, um, yeah, I basically, those are like my, my like, I love you too. That's my soul. Oh, I also love Weezy Waiter. Sometimes I got, I got bored with him when he was on tour. I'm sorry. I don't really care that a lot of these people can sing. Like, the only people that I, like, enjoy listening to when they sing are, like, Hank. Because, like, he sings about things that are relevant to what he speaks about as well. Everyone else, I'm like, you're a YouTube star. I don't really, I liked you because you vlogged to me and you were, like, funny and witty. And I was like, haha, I like ya. I, like, relate to you. I didn't really care that you sang. So I was like, yeah, whatever. I mean, Driftless Pony Club, I would have liked to see them, but I wasn't, like, interested in watching his vlogs all the time about that. But I love, I love Easy Waiter as, like, a, a person, especially when he does his, like, list. When he was, like, talking, his, like, when he was talking about, um, I remember there was, a, there was an episode he did about this guy who left, like, notes on, like, Edgar Allan Poe's, like, gravestone. And he was, like, he, like, he, like, did his lack of W things that whole time. It was great. It was hilarious. But, yes. So those are those are basically my YouTube crushes. Huh, this is like a mask. I like it. Um, so basically it goes like Vlog Brothers, Naramon, Charlie McDonald. It's weird that I call him Naramon, not Alex Day, whatever. Go with it. Naramon uh Vlog Brothers, Alex Day. Now I fixed it. Charlie McDonald, Toby Turner, uh Sexophil. I don't remember who else I said to. Oh, Michael Buckley. That's and we's waiter, you know, the epic five. So, so yeah, if you guys want to tell me your favorites down below or in the videos, dudes, hit me up with that because those are my, those are basically the like what Sarah likes to watch things. So yeah, fun stuff. Okay, TJ, I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.